One crash into one light pole put about 2,100 Pacific Power customers in the dark. Originally, we had about 2,100 customers without power. It happened a little after midnight Sunday. Police say Kenneth Lear of Central Point crashed into a light pole on Beale Lane. Some residents living in the area say they heard something. Heard this big bang. She did too. And then a transformer blew up. Police arrived just four minutes after. Officers say Lear took off on foot and they chased after him. They were able to apprehend the driver um, and get him into custody. Vehicle uh, when it crashed, it caused damage to uh, a city sign, um, several mailboxes, as and as well as a, uh, a telephone pole that it uh, broke off. The suspect doesn't only face charges for this damage. Officers say he was driving under the influence of intoxicants. The officers determined pretty much right away that that he was under the influence and impaired by alcohol. Regardless of why Lear ran into the pole, it was down. Terry Callahan didn't bother calling Pacific Power about the electrical outage. 150 calls. Instead, he threw on some clothes and bolted out the door to see what had happened. The pole was laying down in the street. Somebody had stopped already at that end to stop other cars from coming. With a car that hit it, took out uh, the mailboxes on that side of the road. Fortunately for Callahan and his neighbors, a new pole was already up by Saturday morning and power was back. Got that in place, picked up a few more customers and got it all restored by about 6.30. Covering your news in Central Point, Ariana Rakshani, News 10.